Hello and welcome to Arkham today. What? Oh, oh really? This is not Fallout where you can fucking lock doors by using fucking lockpick on them. So I wanted to... Anyway, as you can see he has 20 perception, I'm invisible. And I'm sneaking invisible. Uh, you can judge with what type of stuff is this. I believe this is one of the Dwemer shield. However, there is identical one. Mm -hmm. I think this is one of the Dwemer shield because he cast. What do you want of me? I did not choose to live on this island for its ambiel. That is quite a fool's journey just to find someone's dead body. I'm afraid to ask. But whose grave would you be looking for? Of course. Searching for the great Nazruddin. Ha! <laughs> the great Nazruddin. What was so great about him? Grand fool, if you ask me. I should have died 2,000 years ago. If not for some foolish instinct of... I would say in all... No. You... It's... I got... it was yeah, as you can see, I have only one response. I am extremely non-engaged in that fucking conversation. Like, from a roleplay perspective, I don't fucking care anymore. Look at this. Uh, this is fucking dialogue game. He upon himself to keep the balance, as he termed it. He believed that being a member of the Council validated any course of action he chose to pursue. This meant attacking anything he saw as a threat. Yes, but can I second quit conversation? Technological devices. He warned them to cease. He felt him. When I regained consciousness, I was on the shore of Thanatos. I'd regained just enough energy. Why do I have two different responses? I remained that way for a thousand years. Whose tale of Krakatoa was a conniving coward who found a way to turn himself into a twisted monster, half man and half dragon. In this form, he terrorized cities and villages, killing their inhabitants and burning them to the ground. After a colossal battle and his defeat at the hands of the Council, he cried and begged us not to banish him. Pathetic. Why it's pathetic? Why it's pathetic? He tried to save his life, I mean... That's reasonable. There is nothing pathetic in trying to save his life and as for his crime, uh, he took his as revenge, as he was always coward, so... What is it that is troubling your thought? Whose tale of woe would you like? The Bane of Cree. Bringing him to justice was what established my reputation as a warrior, which eventually led to legends surrounding me which I had no control over. The Bane was a nomad warrior who was able to gather together nearly all the ancient nomadic tribes and create a vicious army out of them. I became involved when he slaughtered the army of Kree. Yes, so Bane of Kree destroyed the entire city and army of Kree. However, Bane of Kree uh, holds uh, ancestral uh, blade of Torian Kal. What happened then? His legendary courage failed him. And faced with certain defeats, he lost his mind and fled back to Kree. He had his army slaughter every man, woman, and child in his desperation. I do not know what he hoped to accomplish by this. When I caught up with him, I was overcome by a bit of the madman myself. I banished him single-handedly in my fury, which is not an easy thing to do, even then. Okay. So Pik Nasrudin had to like really struggle with himself to punish him, okay. What is it that is troubling your thoughts? I pity you then. I received a taste of their hero worship from Manix, and I can tell you I didn't like the taste of it one bit. Ah, 
I'm well aware of the whole Panari tomfoolery, yes. When I emerged from my regenerative state, I traveled to the mainland. I suppose I thought I could somehow live among the world. After I listened to his insane beliefs for what seemed like hours, I hinted that I'd act. I pity you then. I, I wanna quit. Someone needs to do something about this situation. But I am too old. Your very existence is a mistake I shall rectify. This is the one machine. Okay. You think it's dangerous for me to do anything? He see me, I will not. What the fuck? What do you want of me? I did not choose to look. That is quite the fool's journey to... Of course. Searching for the great Nazruddin. Well, you are looking... I suppose... No. You... It's... I get... It was... Some... He had... He... He felt himself betrayed... What the fuck? When I regained consciousness... Whose tale of... Krakatoa... You risk your very... What the fuck? What is this? Oh, he shrinked me. That's cool. I was wondering if he can die to uh, to all these fucks around. If that's move me to the void also. You think I will go to the void from this? Yes! <laughs> Thanks for watching.